Welcome to Aram Terraza Supply. My name is Nilgün Bandari and we will be talking today design effects of aggregates into terrazzo flooring. Aggregates are made for terrazzo which are dry, dust free and specially sized. They are not regular road aggregates that you see on the street or any other aggregates that are used in the construction industry. Terrazzo aggregates, which we also call them chips, terrazzo chips, they are very special, they are packed differently, sized differently and more meticulously, I should say, not differently, but, but more meticulously. So what are terrazzo chips? We have glass, mother of pearl, we have marble chips. And when you have a terrazzo project, how do you start your design procedure? So the first step when you have a really good, small, big, any terrazzo project, you call Aram Terrazzo Supply. We are there to help you throughout the entire procedure of your design. So you call us and we will first of all, if you want to, we can send you these kits. These are called our sample kits. And it will come in two packages, one for the marble and one for glass. And you will also receive a water bottle along with the set. I will come back to the water bottle idea a little bit later. Or you can get your sample kit, start choosing your own colors. If it's the existing floor matching, you can send us a picture of your floor. We will match your aggregates, which, are the, which belongs to that floor, and send you the samples of the chips. If you want a hard sample, we will be able to get you that too. What's the hard sample? Our sample is a sample which is generally 6x6, made with um, mostly epoxy binder and um, with aggregates to match your terrazzo. So, how do we start making an epoxy sample? First of all, you have to choose your binder. Do you want an epoxy binder or would you like a cement binder? Cementitious floors has to be thicker than epoxy because of the, to achieve a good standard and good quality. This is actually a countertop sample, but I chose them to show you how good they can get if they are made properly. This is a really good sample. So, first of all, you have to choose either epoxy or cement. In this particular option, I am going to go with epoxy. When you, receive, when you look at a good terrazzo floor, what you see, 70% of what you see is going to be chips. The remaining 30% will be your binder's color. And if you receive a sample, when they have so many aggregates nicely, like this particular one, this is a very good sample, you can see 30% of the binder and 70% of aggregates. I am going to show you one more sample. Even though it has only two colors, it has only, it has only amber and opaque white, both of them are glass, but in this particular sample you can clearly see most of the things that you see actually is the binder, the white creamish color binder. To compare that to both, you can see the difference in the quality of making these samples. So when you are looking for a terrazzo floor, the quality goes half homogeneously is the chips are mixed on your floor, starting with your sample. So, if I want to achieve the sample, for example, um, actually I should have chosen a color of this from the swatch, but uh, I don't have it, I have chosen different shades. These are my swatches from Sherwin Williams. You can choose them from Benjamin Moore, Pantone, any other international coloring books. You can choose all of them. It is very important, I recommend all the architects to choose their own color instead of giving it to contractors. You will have so much more control of your color. So, when you choose the color, let's go with Empire Gold. Here, Sherwin Williams Empire Gold. You can communicate with your terrazzo manufacturer or your contractor. I want my color to be Empire Gold from Sherwin Williams. So your epoxy will come through any manufacturing plant matching Sherwin-Williams Empire Gold color. Second thing is one, 
Now that we chose the uh, every base color, what are we trying to achieve? Are we trying to achieve a monochromatic look or are we trying to achieve a contrast or something in the middle? So let's go with the monochromatic look. What can we do? The first monochromatic look achievement we can have is through clear glass. Let's open our glass marble kit. These are very nice. They can be binder in your library and you can keep them for a long, long time. Let me open it and show it to you. This is how they are. And we have all the colors here. And we have uh, recycled products here. And semi-precious chips here. And mother of pearl. These are the sizes that you can, you can get. So, here is my clear glass. You have to press a button here to lock it, unlock it. Every sample kit comes with an instruction. All right, so we put it here. You can make bigger sizes and smaller sizes, but on the floor, after it is grinded, the most monochromatic look you can achieve is through clear glass if you want to use glass however i sincerely do not recommend you to use glass in a heavy public areas heavy traffic areas and also on black because you know as a we think it could be great idea to use clear glass in a black epoxy at the end it really doesn't very dark epoxy colors and clear glass are not very good combination because clear glass can be crushed by time and um, especially in heavy traffic areas i'm not talking about really small offices and big halls those kind of places heavy traffic areas entrances of airports and then entrances of hospitals those kind of places i'm having a difficult time right now to close it because one piece went inside all right i will put this aside for now now so we show you one monochromatic look. Let's go back to marble. Especially if you have a budgeted project, which is a tight budgeted project, I recommend you to use marbles. We have great colors of mini marble chips, and I'm going to show you a monochromatic look of uh, yellow. So. This is the best we can get with marble chips. It has a veining, it has some yellows, it has some whites. And uh, I just before I start the presentation, I chose this color and I was trying and I wet it. Here it is where my marble my, my where my water spray comes handy. I spray it on it. It's not spraying it okay wonderful so then we spray the water on the chips it will give you the actual color of your finished product color so it's very important when you have the chips vetted during your selection of the chips so now you chose your colors you can go with a clear glass you can go with uh, this marble chip color and if you do so the second step is to choose your sizes. As small as you commonly use standard sizes are size 0, 1, and 2. And we are able to crush our own products. We have our own crushing facility. If they are coming from our own, we are able to crush from filler to any size that you would like to have. We also can slice bigger circular or marble pieces to achieve a uh, Venetian or Palladino type of uh, terrazzo flooring. Here it is. We try one thing. Now let's go to the other one. We want to achieve not at all. We want to achieve a complete contrast of a blue floor. So how can we achieve? There are so many, so many options. Now we are going to use marble chips, and this is our marble catalog. As I told you before, you are going to receive one of each in your sample kit so 
This is our empire gold that we have chosen before. We have to find a matching chip to it. Let's look what we have. It looks like this is matching quite a bit to it. Also, it might be this one. We will try both or we will try only one. All right. Now I am choosing something called yellow Verona. And this is yellow Verona size one. Size zero, one and two are standard sizes. And um, these are the common sizes that we all keep in stock. We keep in them, we keep them in stock. Size, any other sizes are custom made orders. If you need a bigger chip, very small chips, they have to be custom made. And in these days, most of the chips takes six to eight weeks to get custom crushed and packed and customize them ship them receive them it takes approximately six to eight weeks let's try our yellow verona on empire gold i am putting my yellow veronas now we will see so this is the color of the marble chip marbles are significantly more price um, significantly better in price I have to say especially you have a tight budgeted project never think of leaving terrazzo you can change the price of terrazzo by using different aggregates here here we are again trying to re re uh, reach a monochromatic look of this particular color we chose and my water bottle comes in handy water bottle we spray the water on the chips because the chip, the color that it is here, which is a dry chip, at the end of the finished product, we are only going to see this color. So your finished seal, completely turned over terrazzo floor, will be showing exactly this color. So your water bottle comes in handy to get as close as the color that you're trying to achieve in your sample and at the end in your floor i think we achieve pretty close to our monochromatic looking terrazzo floor so we will leave this aside you can simply say to your epoxy manufacturer i want empire gold and you can tell me hello nilgun i am here i want italian red verona a yellow verona when i say italian please do not think that they are so expensive we do supply all of these chips in domestic pricing all right i will put this here for now let's go with a contrast example i have chosen this really dark blue and it's called blue blood Ooh, very dark and very blue we can to achieve a contrast color, we can do different things. We can use white marble, black marble, or something to make it contrast. This time I'm going to choose, actually there are white marble chips here. We can just put mar white marble chips, okay? I don't have too many of them in front of me. Again, I wet it your epoxy terrazzo is going to look like this please look at only the area where the chips are there and you are going to have a contrast with blue if you want to i have to say i recently received a request to match samples and the customer wanted a carpet design on their really big living room they did not want to have any kind of carpet because it's a very hot area and they want to have a carpet design corridors, living room and dining room with epoxy terrazzo application. It has been quite a fun project for me to work on it. It has approximately 18 different colors and uh, it is a very nice design. It's an old style, uh, a kind of, I believe it's an Iranian style carpet design, very intricate designs. It is, uh, so we work one by one, one by one to achieve the looks of the uh, carpet. In some places we have to use monochromatic, in some places we have to go really bold colors and sometimes completely contrast with the aggregate. 
I, had, I think we have used almost our entire aggregate chip uh, availability uh, options to achieve the look of a carpet with this design and I really love those projects when we can get uh, very creative so I will go with another color for you this is a cream it is very much used in many different projects and I am going to use mother of pearl mother of pearl as it is the name comes to mother of pearl there are two types of mother of pearl that terrazzo industry uses one is a modern mother of pearl these are modern again i have to wet them for you to see the exact color and these are classic what is the difference many people ask how do i choose which one all right i will take one example of a classic mother of pearl and then i will take another example and another example let me see if i can take some bigger pieces and i'm going to take flat um, modern mother of pearl and you can see them classic is very curvy modern is more flat pieces this is this is price wise also better classic has been in the market for a long time it does give a really nice look it has a lot of shimmer inside uh, shine not a shine and shimmer but it has reflection and we have different types of mother of pearl in classic format we can get them completely bleached in white targeting comes in black and uh, a reflected side of the shell and the shells are different originally they're both recycled products the shell of modern mother of pearl is a big shell you open up like this they are big like this big they are used for pearl industry after the pearl comes out they make buttons out of it and mother of pearl is a completely recycled product of a button industry this thing actually also is because this is the high quality pearl and um, it's not high quality pearl it's not for pearl industry it is for jewelry industry it's a high quality shine reflection on it and it is used for also button industry so both of the products are recycled if you want to go with a complete mother of pearl look you can have it like that however you like it so if you want to if you don't want to go mother of pearl if you don't want to go gloss if you just want to have a nice elegant looking terrazzo achieved by marble chips without having any contrasting or monochromatic look in mind i chose this chelsea move move color from sherwin williams again and i just picked them up there is nothing special about them it's not that like they're my favorite color or so i just happened to pick them up so i'm going to choose something nice i will go a little bit of um, creams which i have them here they're called boston cream all right we are getting there and then i am going to put some white marble chip it is called new pure white because this is from our these are both are from our crushing facility we produce these this is our chips and then we can also go let's try if you should add some red or if not you can add some little bit of a red in it Okay, I'm going to add a shade of a darker color of cream in it. Maybe you cannot see the shade difference, but when we wet them, you will see the difference. And I will be adding. So, okay, I told you we are not going to add any mother of pearl, so I will not be adding any mother of pearl. I will be adding a tiny bit of. 
uh, gray. We have something called dolphin gray. I'm going to add that one. All right. I think we are ready. What do you think? We almost feel the 70% of our wash. I am truly sorry my sample kits to show the color exactly carries only size 2 marble chips. Mostly size 2 marble chips. And uh, yeah, I have some size zeros here. Let me fill them in. Ooh -hoo. Now I think I made too much of it. Okay. Now here comes my molly bottle. This is my terrazzo floor. Here it is for your service. Our terrazzo supplies all your aggregate needs. We are the company, we are specialty aggregate supplier. We are a woman miner to own. I am the owner of the company. I do have a civil engineering background. And uh, if you have any drawings, specifications, any kind of help during the procedure to the specify terrazzo and design terrazzo, we are here to help. If you have any questions, please always email to our customer service cs at aramstone.com 